ANSI C, ISO C, and Standard C refer to the successive standards for the C programming language published by the American National Standards Institute and the International Organization for Standardization. Historically, the names referred specifically to the original and best supported version of the standard known as C89 or C90. Software developers writing in C are encouraged to conform to the standards, as doing so helps portability between compilers. Topic history and outlook The first standard for C was published by ANSI. Although this document was subsequently adopted by International Organization for Standardization and subsequent revisions published by ISO have been adopted by ANSI, ANSI C is still used to refer to the standard. While some software developers use the term ISO C, others are standards body neutral and use standard C. C89 in 1983, the American National Standards Institute formed a committee, X3J11, to establish a standard specification of C. The standard was completed in 1989 and ratified as ANSI X3.159-1989 This version of the language is often referred to as ANSI C. Later on sometimes the label C89 is used to distinguish it from C99 but using the same labeling method. Topic C90 The same standard as C89 was ratified by the International Organization for Standardization as ISO, IEC 9899-1990, with only formatting changes, which is sometimes referred to as C90. Therefore, the terms C89 and C90 refer to essentially the same language. This standard has been withdrawn by both ANSI, INCITS and ISO, IEC. Topic C95 In 1995, the ISO published an extension, called Amendment 1, for the ANSI C standard. Its full name finally was ISO, IEC 9899, AMD 1-1995 or nicknamed C95. Aside from error correction there were further changes to the language capabilities, such as, improved multi-byte and wide character support in the standard library, introducing and as well as multi-byte I.O. addition of digraphs to the language specification of standard macros for the alternative specification of operators, e.g. and for and and specification of the standard macro underscore underscore stdc underscore version underscore underscore in addition to the amendment, two technical core agenda were published by ISO for C. 90, ISO, IEC 9899 TCOR1 in 1995 ISO, IEC 9899 TCOR2 in 1996 Topic Preprocessor test for C95 Compatibility Topic C99 In March 2000, ANSI adopted the ISO, IEC 9899-1999 standard. This standard is commonly referred to as C99. Some notable additions to the previous standard include, new built-in data types, long long, underscore bool, underscore complex, and underscore imaginary several new core language features, including static array indices, designated initializers, compound literals, variable length arrays, flexible array members, variadic macros, and restrict keywords several new library headers, including stdint, h, fe and v, h, improved compatibility with several C++ features, including inline functions, single-line comments with, mixing declarations and code, and universal character names in identifiers removed several dangerous C89 language features such as implicit function declarations and implicit int3 technical core agenda were published by ISO for C99, ISO, IEC 9899-1999, core, 1-2001, e, ISO, IEC 9899-1999, core, 2-2004, E ISO IEC 9899-1999 Core 3-2007 E Notable for deprecating the standard library function gets this standard has been withdrawn by both ANSI INCITS and ISO IEC in favor of C11. Topic C11 as of 2018 C11 is the previous standard for the C programming language. Notable features introduced over the previous revision include improved Unicode support, type generic expressions using the new underscore generic keyword, a cross-platform multi-threading API, threads, H, and atomic types support in both core language and the library Saint Atomic, H. 
One technical corrigendum has been published by ISO for C11, ISO, IEC 9899-2011, Core 1-2012 Topic C18 As of October 2018, C18 is the current standard for the C programming language. Topic other related ISO publications As part of the standardization process, ISO also publishes technical reports and specifications related to the C language, ISO, IEC TR 19769-2004, on library extensions to support Unicode transformation formats, integrated into C11 ISO, IEC TR 24731-1-2007, on library extensions to support bounds checked interfaces, integrated into C11 ISO, IEC TR 18037-2008, on embedded C extensions ISO, IEC TR 24732-2009, on decimal floating point arithmetic, superseded by ISO, IEC TS 18661-2-2015 ISO, IEC TR 24747-2009, on special mathematical functions, ISO, IEC TR TR 24731-2-2010, on library extensions to support dynamic allocation functions ISO, IEC TS 17961-2013, on secure coding in C ISO, IEC TS 18661-1-2014, on IEC 60559-2015, on IEC 60559-2015, compatible binary floating point arithmetic ISO, IEC TS 18 2061-2-2015, on IEC 60559-2011 Compatible Decimal Floating Point Arithmetic ISO, IEC TS 18661-3-2015, on IEC 60559-2011 Compatible Interchange and Extended Floating Point Types ISO, IEC TS 18661-4-2015, on IEC 60559-2011 Compatible supplementary functions More technical specifications are in development and pending approval, including the fifth and final part of TS 18661, a software transactional memory specification, and parallel library extensions. Topic support from major compilers ANSI C is now supported by almost all the widely used compilers. Most of the C code being written nowadays is based on ANSI C. Any program written only in standard C and without any hardware-dependent assumptions is virtually guaranteed to compile correctly on any platform with a conforming C implementation. Without such precautions, most programs may compile only on a certain platform or with a particular compiler, due, for example, to the use of non-standard libraries, such as GUI libraries, or to the reliance on compiler or platform-specific attributes such as the exact size of certain data types and byte endianness. Topic compliance detectability To mitigate the differences between K and RC and the ANSI C standard, the underscore underscore STDC underscore underscore standard C macro can be used to split code into ANSI and K and R sections. In the above example, a prototype is used in a function declaration for ANSI compliant implementations, while an obsolescent non-prototype declaration is used otherwise. Those are still ANSI compliant as of C99. Note how this code checks both definition and evaluation, this is because some implementations may set underscore underscore stdc underscore underscore to zero to indicate non-ANSI compliance. Topic compilers supporting ANSI C Amsterdam Compiler Kit CK and R and C8990 ARM RealView Clang, using LLVM backend GCC full C8990, C99 and C11 HPC, ANSI C Compiler C89 and C99 IBM XLC, C++ C11, starting with version 12.1 Intel's ICC Lab Windows, CVILCC OpenWatcom C8990 and some C99 Microsoft Visual C++ C8990 and some C99 Pell C C99 and C11 
Windows only, VBCC C89 and C99 Tiny C compiler C89 and some C99 Oracle Developer Studio Dev C++ Topic C Also compatibility of C and C++ C++ 17, C++ 14, C++ 11, C++ 03, C++ 98, versions of the C++ programming language standard C++ technical report 1 Topic References Topic External links ISO C working Group Draft ANSI C Standard ANSI X3 J1188-090 May 13, 1988, Third Public Review Draft ANSI C Rationale ANSI X3 J1188-151 November 18, 1988, C Information Bulletin No. 1 ANSI X3 J1193-007 May 27, 1992, ANSI CYACC Grammar ANSI C Grammar, Lex Specification Schreiner, Axel Tobias Object-Oriented Programming with ANSI C. Hanser. HDL, 1858544. ISBN 3-446-17426-5. ISO, IEC 9899-1999 Programming Languages, C. American National Standards Institute. Archived from the original on 25 July 2011. Retrieved 6 August 2009. ANSI Standards Action Vol. 36, No. 48 PDF. American National Standards Institute, 2 December 2005.